Hi, y'all. Hey, friends. So it's our first C-Day. Our anniversary. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. 18 years. Wow. We want to talk a little bit about what we're going to do today. We are first going to start out with Sea Day Brunch. If you didn't know, they actually serve Sea Day Brunch with a full menu in one of the dining rooms. You'll have to check with your ship to see which one. But they serve that from what is it, 8.30 to, and this is my fun times, um, 8.30 to 1. So, um, one thing, while well, I've got my fun times out, that I want to tell you, we go through our fun time each night when they bring it to us, they'll put it on your bed, and we go through and we bring a highlighter, and we highlight what we want to do for the next day that way, and we keep it in our bag. That way, we don't miss anything that we might want to do. One thing that we are going to try this cruise, tea time. And tea time is in one of the dining rooms also. It's going to be from 3 to 4, and they serve tea and like appetizers, goodies, so we've always done the taste bar. I love the taste bar, but for some reason Carnival got rid of that. But taste bar was usually around five o'clock. We always pick the late dinner time so that we don't have to rush back from ports. So we would go down get taste bar, but they don't have the taste bar anymore. So we're gonna try tea time. We like the shopping show because we like to know where we can go in port, the, the safest places to go because not every place in port is somewhere that you should buy your stuff. Um, so we like to go to the shopping show to see what's the best places in each port. What's your thought on the sunshine? This is our first time on the sunshine. So far I like it. I love it. What do you like about it? I've said it before, it's small, it's a smaller ship, you can get around a little easier. Probably just about right. I do really like it. I mean, you could go into the top of my list and might just pass the magic. We are in a great location. We are three cabins down from going off the 11th. The bottom, the bottom deck, the Serenity deck here is three stories. We're three doors down from the very lower bottom story, so we're right by the pool. I don't think it's very noisy. I was afraid that it would be noisy, it's not. but it's it hasn't bothered us. When we open our cabin door to go out in the hall, we can kind of hear the music and stuff and people. But inside the cabin, I haven't heard anything of you. No. Except the normal people slamming doors that don't think about what they're doing. So, but anyway, anything else? Let's go eat. Right. So we're about to start our day. We're going to take you with us. What did we just get done watching? <laughs> it's short, short yeah, excursions. Yeah, short excursions. A different uh, excursion at uh, different ports. We didn't win one. Let's see if we can win something from the shoppers show. We'll see what happens. Build out our, our horn. But uh, I want to talk about the map you get by coming to the show? We used to we used to get them like one at a time just before the port before we come into the port but this time they give them all to us at the same time. Well no yeah when you come to the show you get them and then oh, you get them as you go to the port. Oh I always thought we got them there. Yeah. No when yeah when you come to the show they give them all to you because they're going to talk about them. St. Kitts and St. Martin. Martin and that's it. Two days to see. Right. All right, we're getting ready to start with the Caribbean shopping show, so I need some excitement. Who would like to win some prizes? <laughs> Very well done. You're going to win lots of prizes here during the show. Some I will raffle up and some I will throw up. Now, for that reason, come and sit down at the bottom. I do throw like a girl, so I don't throw very far. You guys are great. You guys need to call me. You guys, um, good luck. Yes? Come sit down at the bottom so we can make sure you get some prizes. Who's excited to win some prizes? Yes! Who wants to win diamond jewelry from Diamond International? Alright, who's cruised before? We're European cruises. Yes! Who's been to a store called Dal Sol before? 
Tour. Yes, concentrating. So we're going to give away prizes from them as well. So let's just quickly show you some of the items that we're going to be giving away. Thank you. It's white coconut cream. It's what now? It's white coconut cream tea. And Art. how much extra was it for that one? I think it was about 95. 95 extra. Otherwise you could have got the regular like lip tin and, and just the stuff you can buy in the store. That would be free. So we're at the tea time. This is the first time we've done this, so it's kind of different. Yeah. We don't know what we're doing. <laughs> well, that's fine. I mean, why come on a ship to go cruising to get something you can get at home when you get something that you can't get at home here. Right. Yeah, I think we're going to have to go to lunch when we leave here. That doesn't really look like something I would eat. Cucumber maybe? Oh, lemon cake? Yeah. I hear lemon cake. You want two pieces? There's our cute little napkins that were on our plate. <laughs> Coconut. I love coconut. It smells like coconut. Oh, okay, now here comes some stuff that looks like what I want. You love it? Yes. So it was worth one ninety five. Yes. Are you liking tea time so far? Yeah, I mean, this is this is a good, good just mid morning snack to get you through the mid afternoon just to get you through till dinner time. Yeah, this is our lunch. For lunch, well, I'm you having. Can eat, you can eat lunch at twelve and come and do this now. Dessert. <laughs> Try my tea. Oh, that's really good. Are you gonna want some of this? No, not if you won't let me. If you won't let me, I'll, I'll, I'll let you taste it. I think she already took a picture of the peach crumble. But this is the view that I got. Stuff that I don't need to eat. So this has. I don't know what this is. An apple, maybe? That's an apple. <laughs> This is so much better than the taste bar. And it's not a good thing Carnival took the taste bar away then. <laughs> hey, hey, hey John, uh, how you say his name? John Hill? <laughs> John Hill? Good thing they took the taste bar. What did you think of your first tea time? It's pretty good. I liked it. We usually call this pretty food. So what did you think of? You didn't have to pay for it. That's the biggest well, thing. It's pretty food. Because you know, because most of the time with pretty food. Yeah. I don't know, man, it's about 95, that's fine. But otherwise, it's pretty cool. You get something about like that and you pay a dog on fortune for it. Yeah. I like the food. It's paying such an enormous price for a little bit of food. It Some people like much, it. But it was just enough. Yeah, that's what I said. I mean, you go do one, and you come down here and you do this, and it makes for a good afternoon snack, tied you over till dinner time. So that you ain't going up to the little bit. Because what we used to do, we used to stuff our face on. Too. We haven't stuffed our face this week, and I have not been miserable. Yeah, that's exactly. Long. Plenty of time we'd get so much that it would be miserable. All they would do is go back to the cabin and, so and is rest. This, is this a do-over? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll continue to do it. This, this will take a place of the... It's only on sea days. I just Somebody had posted this on one of the cruise forums, and I've seen it on the fun times. I just didn't know what it was. Mm -hmm. Someone posted pictures, and I saw the food, and I thought, ooh, that sounds good. Can I can put down any more in? This is the sunrise. Yeah. This is the sunrise upper. So here's the sunrise. We just had tea time in here. I like that gold ball. I like this thing. But this is an eye dining room. Pretty, huh? Yeah, it is. <laughs> It'd be pretty neat sitting back here watching the watching the ship as it's going, watching the water go by. Might make us sick though. Okay. Be all right. Ready? Yep. Do we have any goodies? Well, looky there. Oh my goodness! We have all kind of goodies. There's goodies in our mailbox. 
Lots of goodies hanging on our door. So goodies in the door. floor. We have some more notes. Our board's getting filled up. Cool. There's our elephant. So now we're fixing to get ready for formal night for dinner. Formal night. This will be our this is our first sea day, so it's our first formal night. We'll have two formal nights with this cruise. We just came in our cabin and what do we see? A ship on a stick and what else is there? Champagne. I believe it's chocolate covered strawberries. Ooh. It is. Cool. What does it say? And the best part is it's from John Hill. What Thanks it, John. What does it say? I can't see. It says with compliments Senior Cruise Director and Brand Ambassador. Of course, we compliment John Hill, Senior Cruise Director and Ambassador. Jessica Bryant, Cruise Director, Carnival Sunshine 2018. Cool, thanks John. Thank you John. So what happened just now? What, you didn't say it? Yeah, but that, I'll put some of it on this video, but we won't put the whole thing, because <laughs> it was 34 minutes long, but. Was it really? What, what happened? Well, we were standing on the steps listening to a bunch of, uh... It was the 60s, 70s, and 80s trivia music. Yeah. Down that in the lobby. It. And it got to the end when he, he said there was going to be a winner. And he yeah. picked eight people out of the crowd. And I was one of the ones he picked. I was hoping he wouldn't pick me because I don't like <laughs> to do this kind of stuff. You did awesome. I was so proud. But uh, he picked me and I think it's because of Pop Pop's kilt. Pop Pop's kilt is lucky. Yep. So it got narrowed down to four. Then it got narrowed down to two. And then we both won. That's okay. I enjoyed it. What did you win? Uh, another bottle of champagne. What else did you get? Ah, jeez. It only took us six cruises to get a ship on a stick. Ship and now we stick. got two ship on sticks. And what else? Got a sunshine medallion. Cool. We'll have to turn that into a Christmas ornament. <laughs> gotcha. Unless you want to keep it and wear it oh, like that. Oh, no. I think you should wear it the next, the rest of the cruise. You should wear that. <clears throat> and I have to tell you that um, it was pretty cool because we went back to the Lido deck and then walked all the way back to the front of the ship. And how many times did you get stopped and congratulated? Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know, six, eight times. <laughs> I'm, I imagine it'll be going on the whole cruise now. Right, <laughs> exactly. That's pretty exciting. Yeah. So let us get changed and we will do our daily review. We forgot to do our day review yesterday because we were so tired. We will talk our about it. Our daily review was sleeping. Yeah, because we went to the movie, the 10 o'clock movie, and it was late when we got back. But Yeah, well, that's late now. Yeah, let us get changed because we're both hot. And we'll finish this video up with a daily review. I'm tired. Are you tired? Yes, I've I'm been really dancing. I'm really tired. He has been dancing. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. I I enjoyed yeah. it. I didn't. I don't like uh, doing stuff like that. I just don't like all the attention. Don't like the attention. Just. But I had a good time and enjoyed it. You did awesome. I'm so proud of you. But this is so, gonna be a recap of our day. This is our first sea day. It was a busy sea day. We. We're actually behind on our gifts, getting our gifts ready and getting them out. Usually we would hand out our gifts the first sea day. So sorry guys if you're watching this video. Sorry we didn't get them to you today, but we have so many gifts we haven't even had a chance to look at yet. Yep. So we'll do that in just a few minutes, but hit it. I'm going to give you a recap <laughs> of what we've done today. First off, we got up, had breakfast in the Lido deck. Scrambled eggs, bacon. Pancakes. I Pan pancakes. Yeah, yeah, pancakes. And I brought my own maple syrup. Yep. Um, I'm so glad they didn't confiscate it. <laughs> I was nervous that they would confiscate it, but they didn't. Yeah. So. And then we went to the uh, Fun Ashore, Fun Abroad. That was with Chris, the uh, the cruise director. We talked about the excursions on you know, the islands and the ports of call and what's at each the excursion are. Okay. They. Uh, they gave away a bunch of stuff. They gave away some excursions and what else they give away? 
Um, so you, you fill out raffle tickets and they give away excursions to each port. Oh. They gave away the steakhouse, didn't they? A, um, I believe they did give away yeah, stuff like, like that. A bottle of wine and the steakhouse. A couple of the um, specialty restaurants they gave away. And I can't remember what else. That was this morning. I'm tired. Yeah, but then they, they also <laughs> talked about uh, they talked about like the chef's table that we do every year. Right. That's tomorrow night for us. Yeah, and they done. Uh, they talked about behind the scenes. That's yeah. when you get. Oh, the, didn't they give one of those away? Did they? I think they did. If they I do would that, love that. That'd be neat because you go every place that you can't go now. They take you down to the engine room. You talk to the engineer, and you go up to the bridge and. I don't know if they talk up there because it's generally pretty quiet up there. So that's like I'm just like in here what the captain's saying or what uh, you get to go to the galley. We uh, we'll go to the galley tomorrow night. Yeah, that's where we bought our fun finds book. It said it's got what about two thousand dollars worth oh. of stuff in it. Yep. And you pay twenty five dollars for it. But, but you get free. You get a good bit of free stuff. The one, a couple of the things that I really like about it. I love Del Sol. I don't know if you've been to Del Sol yet, but it's color changing stuff. Like, I have the. Uh, my glasses are around here somewhere. If you've seen some of our videos, and sometimes it looks like I have kind of beige glasses on, and then sunglasses, and then sometimes they look kind of clear. They change colors, and they're amazing. I love, love, love. I have three pair of them, and my mom has two, two or three pair. And one thing about them, if you break them, They'll they replace, replace them. them. If you lose them, they'll replace them. And it does not take long because actually my mom just about two weeks ago broke her pair that we got her for Christmas. And the only thing, they give you a card to, that it, I just keep mine in my sunglass case. And all she had to do was call that number, put, give them the card that she, the, the number that was on the card that she had. And she got brand new glasses within a week. No problems, no shipping, nothing. And they're a lifetime guarantee. So even if she were to break that pair, they're gonna send her another pair of glasses, but um, Kelly had actually went and got some prescription lenses, sunglass um, lenses for sunglasses made, and put in them frames. Right. Prescription. So I mean, it's like you get a new pair of glasses if you break them. Mm -hmm. So one of my pair, I've got three pair, like I said, but one of them has my actual prescription in it. But they also in the in the coupon book, you get a free color changing bag. And we've got a couple of these, but I really like them. So when you go out in the sun, I know he keeps saying, you don't need any more bags. You don't bags. need any more bags. Guess what but bags hold? I know. Junk, junk. And we're trying to get rid of junk. Um, but then also they've got, at Tanzanite, they've got a free selfie stick. Well, our selfie stick broke. And then there's a bunch of coupons in here. Um, but also at that show, was it that show? No. Yeah, that show she gives you VIP. No, no, we're we're still talking about fun ashore, fun abroad. We ain't talked about the Caribbean shopping yet. No, that's not where we got our coupon book. Oh, we didn't. <laughs> My bad. Okay, let's jump ahead. Okay. We're that's Caribbean shopping. Some or what was it? Caribbean it's, shopping. What? It's late and we're tired. Yeah, and that was with the uh, Charmaine. She's the what your shopping expert. Yeah. She's our shopping expert. So she could be yours. Every carnival ship has a shopping expert, a personal shopper. So if you have an idea, and that's how we got my blue diamond. So Michael replaced my my diamond. We lost my diamond 2004. <laughs> and so um, two cruises ago, we replaced it with a blue diamond. And I like the blue diamond because it reminds me of the Caribbean. But we used one of Carnival's personal shoppers to help us find this ring and we got a really good deal on it. So that's a good thing. I mean we've we've utilized them just about every trip. So yeah, that they gave away <clears throat> she gave away some necklaces and what else she gave away? Some earrings. I didn't win that. She gave some of the Kerry Loha bam was it bamboo necklaces yeah. that she gave away. She gave away a bunch of them. We, we got some of them got already. Some of those we didn't need anymore. Yeah. And she gave away some Del Sol stuff, the, yep, the color-changing yep, t-shirts yep, shirts and away and, and glasses. Oh, yeah, she did give away a pair. Of but after that, we went and done tea time. That was pretty good. It was our first time doing it. We got the white coconut. Oh, Man, amazing. that was delicious. Loved it. Yeah. That was $1.95 really extra, but that's okay. It was worth it. It was a new experience. 
I had uh, cucumber sandwiches. I gave him mine. I don't like it. Yeah, and then, of well, course, you know what she got? She got dessert. I had dessert for lunch. See, she had lemon cake. <laughs> she had chocolate cake. So after that, we come back and we got uh, we got dressed. Mm -hmm. We got the Lovebird gift card from. Uh, oh yeah, I I made is his name. Our room steward's name is I made. He's got a pretty cool name. It's just like it says, the letter I and M A D E. I made. Yeah. That's a fifty dollar spa gift card. He gave that to us for our anniversary. anniversary. Oh. But then we dressed up, got dressed. How long take you to get dressed? Not as long as you. Well, <laughs> it's been a while since I put the kilt on, and yeah, I'm kind of getting sentimental, to thinking about Pop Pop when I was oh, putting it on. And really? Yeah, it's pretty neat. Getting it's pretty yeah. neat getting dressed up. Uh, when this being your first time wearing his dress kilt, that was amazing. Yeah, got to put the socks on, got to put the garter and the flashes on. And I got pretty choked up when I saw you with it on the first it. time, yeah. It was I perfect. Enjoyed it though. Really perfect. Then we went and done photos. We got, what, five or six of them? Yeah, we'll look at those tomorrow. Hopefully there's some good ones out of there because this, I really wanted good photos with this being the first time Michael wore Pop Pop's kilt. I mean, he'll wear it many more times, but yeah. this is just kind of a sentimental, it's a sentimental time, so I yeah. miss my pop-pop. We all do. He's yeah. an awesome man. But I think that kilt <laughs> had good luck in it. I oh, bet yeah. you, I just felt pop-pop was with him because my pop-pop oh, was just, just, he's just, he was crazy. And he would, he was just out there. So, I don't know. Did you feel pop pop with you when you got called out and you were just? <laughs> well, I figured that's why I got called out because of pop pop, because I just killed. Yeah. But then we went to dinner. Um, dinner. We got uh, Rolando, is the head waiter, and Mike is the uh, is assistant, this I guess. Assistant. And then Jenny Lynn <clears throat> is the other one that works with them. So we got three, and we got to talk with them. All three of them are from uh, the Philippines. What you waiting on me to talk about the next one? Yeah. <laughs> I can't read it. Oh, we have notes. And they're big notes this time so that he can see them. Yeah. The next one was the 70s and Motown trivia party. Man, oh man. <laughs> I was sitting there, was singing along with everybody. I mean, I had all the way up to deck seven, well, deck eight. Yeah. They had people on deck eight that were looking down, watching. Um, Chris was up on the bar. He had on a black wig. He was in the 70s, I guess. Yeah, that, uh, we got singing on that, and then, what do you say, we got some famous people here? Yeah, and I, I have it all on video, but, and I'll probably put a splice a little bit of it into this video, but not the whole thing. Start out with eight people, and they, the crowd got the vote on who got to move on, and I'm sitting there thinking, well, I hope I don't make, I hope I don't make the first <laughs> cut. I get cut. Oh, you want, you didn't want to get yeah, cut? Yeah, I didn't want to keep on going. I don't like that. Oh, you wanted to get cut. Yeah, but uh. they kept on going. Yeah, they went to four. Yep. Then they went down to two. And then that was just the two of us, and we were singing. Uh, it was, uh, oh, what is it, Bohemian Rhapsody, I think it was. Oh, yeah, yeah. We got singing that, and we had to act. He says it was interpretive. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> yeah, it was interpretive dance, so... We might get to see some of that too, but it I'll, was pretty good. I enjoyed I'll it. I'll try to put some of that in here. <laughs> but we both won. If so. not, then search our video. Um, I'll it's I'll name it. What was it called? Oh yeah, you won sun, uh, champagne. Some champagne, and then of course a ship on a stick and a medallion. We got a ship on a stick. Both him and I did. Well, this is, we actually got two ship on the sticks and two bottles yep. of champagne today. Yep. This is a pretty good anniversary. Yep. We come back to our room. We had some more gifts. And mm -hmm. then, uh, from our cruise outside friends. Outside our door, then inside our door in our room, we had the ship on a stick from John Held and some strawberries, chocolate, chocolate covered, covered strawberries. strawberries. How did you know, John, that that's my favorite? Oh, is that what you told him? No. Oh. I didn't. <laughs> And then, of course, we got another uh, bottle of wine. So, or, That's I'm sorry, awesome. champagne. Yeah. We got champagne. That's awesome. So, Thanks, John. <laughs> yes, thank you, John. He's amazing. Oh, and if, you, if you're new to cruising or if you don't know already, John Held, H-E-A-L-D, is the cruise um, brand and, ambassador. 
and he has a Facebook page and he posts a lot of like questions and comments and things that are going to go on with the cruises and he gets to cruise on the cruise I, I would love to cruise with him one day maybe one day but go look up his page because it's pretty amazing and he does live videos just about every day but you find out a lot of information about carnival on his page so that's it is that all yeah we're back in the room and we're ready to turn I'm in exhausted we have a lot of gifts we'll go through those tomorrow maybe yep but tomorrow we're going to be in grand turk it's our favorite um and we'll tell you we'll we'll post a video about grand turk one thing well the reason we started this channel is so that we could i research i'm a penny pincher i would rather take more cruises and spend less on the cruise that we're on so that we can take more cruises so i research every port that we go to and i find out what can we do free or very cheap and grand turk is one of our favorites because you don't have to do anything you can step off of the ship and there's the beach and you can walk a few feet down the beach and find jack shack and two of the most famous cool beach dogs that you'll ever find calypso and topher so we're gonna go and visit calypso and topher and play in the sand with them anyway well, we're gonna end it here mm -hmm. Until next time. See y'all. Till tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow? Yes. <laughs> See y'all. Bye. Be blessed.